my career had barely just begun. I was involved in a coroner's case. It was in many ways the darkest point of my medical career. I hope you never need that level of support from MDA National. I'll never forget the support they provided to me when I was a junior doctor. We know how hard our members work. We also practice in an environment of greater scrutiny from the regulator. We practice in, in an environment of intrusion from the courts. Welcome to an organisation that's here to support you. You found your way to a wonderful Doctors for Doctors organisation there. Uh, it's really important that you know that we're there for you when you need that support. People would be surprised to know the depth of the information that we need to be across. Sometimes you'll speak to a doctor and they'll say at the end of the call, I'm so glad I called, I didn't realise that you could help us with things like this. It's something they might have been stressing about for a while. Many doctors will say, oh, I just wish I called you sooner. He almost wanted to blame himself and I would drive him to the court every day. He said that was the best distraction from the trial because my driving was so bad. So, you know, I sat with him, I held his hand in the back of the court. I'm absolutely passionate about this area of law. I come from three generations of surgeons. It's pretty confronting for a doctor to receive a set of allegations against them. No matter what type of doctor you are, no matter how good you are, um, bad things happen. Relationships are incredibly important to us, so we have people who have been working here for 20 years and they've been assisting the same doctors with different issues that they may have faced over the course of their career. We will make sure that when you're contacting MDA National, you will be dealing with someone that you're familiar with and that you feel comfortable with and that you can build an ongoing relationship with. While members are very, very good at the medicine, they need assistance with paperwork and contracts. And it's not fun reading an insurance policy. We don't want it to be complicated. Insurance policies are complicated. We, we do try and explain things in a way that would make sense. Our members should know exactly what they're covered for and what they're not covered for. It shouldn't be vague. These are matters that sort of affect their personal life, not only their professional life. And so I think in these sort of matters, it does sort of pay to have a familiar face, someone that you know, someone that you trust, we see emails coming from members at like 2 a.m., 3 a.m. and it just makes you realise like that's probably when they have free time. You know, given everything that our members have going on, we're making our members' lives easier by supporting them. So we're here to help, we're here to answer any questions that you might have. So pick up the phone and call us, call us, um, call us and we're here. Our support and practice team is a part of um, our doctor's membership. We look at the systems and the setup. You know, generally, doctors are very good at being doctors, but they not, might not be so great at managing a business or a practice. We will go in and work directly with the practice and the team to look at sorting out their systems and their processes and making sure that things go a bit more smoothly in the future to try and stop things going wrong. So if something happens that doctors need to know about now, then we can produce a blog and, and get that up and running in a day or so. When we're feeling a particular trend about something, we're getting a lot of calls about a particular issue. Everything that comes through the medico-legal line, that's how we determine what goes into Defence Update. Education is a really critical part of a doctor's um, professional development. The education programs that we do offer are CPD recognised with the specialist medical colleges. Between um, the six or so different formats that we've got available, uh, there should be something to suit every doctor's learning style and preference and also make it accessible for our doctors. The programs available equip doctors in staying on top of all sorts of medical legal risks and keep them practising safer as doctors. What we are out there to ultimately do, letting doctors know things will happen in their practice and sometimes it's not a matter of if it's going to happen, it's more likely to be a matter of when. So you've got this big organisation with experts who can come to me and I can help escalate it to the right department, the right body. You call me, I'll sort it.
we're not just an insurance company. Uh, we're a mutual company of doctors who happen to own an insurance company. We're there for you, whatever support you need, whether that's educational services to prevent you ever getting a claim or the support that you need uh, in the event of a patient complaint. Um, we're there for you when you need us. That includes our deep doctor involvement in our key committees, like our cases committee and underwriting committee, where we have doctors in practice informing the decisions we make every day to help support you.